What's up, KP Nation? It's your girl, Rick Shade. I'm back with another vlog. So, you guys, today, as y'all can see, y'all, this girl just don't want me to sit down. Like, she could sit down, but I can't sit down. So, it's like, at this point, she just want me to cook for her every day. As if I'm some type of housewife or something. Because at this point, housewife me, please. But, in What's up, KP Nation? It's your girl, Rick Shade. I'm back with another video. Anyways, you guys, I am making shrimp and grits. You guys, I would say for breakfast, but it, it's like midday. Don't care. We eating shrimp and grits right now. And then the fact that I'm making two full course meals in one day is crazy. Um, And then later on, I will be making beef tips, you guys. So it's looking like I'm going to vlog this whole day and everything I cook today for y'all. Yeah, but right now we're cooking down the sausage and the veggies. Because I put some andouille sausage in my shrimp and grits, y'all. It busts. And I even got some lobster tails in the oven. It just hit different, okay? It just hit different. So, yeah, we will be eating. Eating real good in about a good 30 minutes. But let me go ahead and cook, the, cook these grits and get it going. And I'll be back. So y'all, I put the shrimp in here. I'm about to season it all. We got the grits cooking, y'all. I ain't gonna lie, I hate making grits because of how quick they, um, how quick they, what's gonna call it? But what you doing? What you making? No. I mean, well, y'all would say she cleaned the kitchen. So, you know, I, I'll give you that. Okay. Yeah, now go put your goodies away. Oh wait, they never seen your in your finished tattoo. Now this look real good. <laughs> Didn't have your tramp stamp showing? What is wrong with you? Have some class. We gonna cross that out, y'all. So you see what that girls? We gonna put an X over it and put crochet. Thank y'all. Can you check the tails or something? Do something useful, please. You just got everything out your tramp stamp, girl. You just don't care. And I just pulled them drawers up and you pulled them back down. Yeah, I don't, know how, I don't know how I ended up with a little tramp, but. You keep calling me a tramp. It's crazy. What's a better name for it? Big Daddy V. Let's see, tramp activity. Close your mouth. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, little candy corn. Come here. Give the fuck. Come here. Y'all, she said she can't. You can't. Close your mouth. Damn, something pushing against your lip. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm just playing. Okay, y'all. So, I'm about to assemble my shrimp and grits. This is how I assemble mine. Everybody make theirs different, but this is how I prefer mine. So, if y'all grits not moist, I don't know what to tell you. Because I don't like dry, crunchy grits. Dry, dry, crunchy grits. I don't like dry, crunchy grits. <laughs> Okay, so now that's the grits, okay? Now I gotta get the shrimp and everything and put it on top. Y'all, if y'all not make shrimp and grits, I need to learn. This is one of the quickest meals ever. Like, I'm not gonna hold you. And it's gonna hit every time. Hold on. Right. She not even listening to me, y'all. Whatever. That's okay, because when I eat this plate of shrimp and grits in her face and she don't get nothing, I don't want to hear what? I don't hear nothing, because she not even kind of listening to me talk. She not even kind of listening to me talk. 
You ain't here, then I just say it. I asked you a whole question. What'd you say? Don't even worry about it now, sweetheart. I said shrimp and grits is one of the quickest and easiest meals, and it's going to bust every time. Every time. Don't be trying to co-sign now. You're late. Yeah. you late to the party. Y'all shouldn't really eat cheese for real, but it's just not complete without, so I'm going to give her a baby scoop of cheese because... got baby bowels so this is all she gets but I'm not done I'll be right back hold on so y'all these is done I'm about to put these on the plate and then I'm gonna show y'all the finished product as we feed this fat ass girl Y'all, so my secret ingredient when I make shrimp and grits is Alfredo sauce, okay? I love putting Alfredo sauce in my shrimp and grits because, one, who wants dry shrimp and grits? And then the Alfredo with the the creaminess of the grits with the shrimp, the sausage, and then the sauce that was made with the shrimp and the sausage all together, it just hit different. Like, y'all don't understand the level of hit different that it hits. But I'm just saying. So, y'all, these are the lobsters come apart and we're just gonna take it y'all what's crazy is I used to you know I love cooking for I love cooking for uh, hold on I got distracted I start eating all right <laughs> y'all I love cooking for the person I'm with right it's just, I would say, I'll cook every day. I have no issue doing that. You know, I feel like long as I'm good, we good, period. But once you start tripping, baby, I'll stop cooking. And we would never eat, like literally, ever. I, we would both starve. I'm going to starve myself just to prove a point. And point will get proven. Because what? I'm going to starve myself. I've done it before. Sitting up is crazy. Ooh. Ooh, baby. Mm. Now, is that what you wanted? Yeah. Because I'm like, y'all, she been asking for the shrimp and grits with the sausage since the first time she had it. But see, she ain't never had it with lobster. Mm. She ain't had fish and grits, shrimp and grits, regular shrimp and grits, shrimp and grits with bacon, shrimp and grits with sausage, now shrimp and grits with lobster and sausage. I don't know how many more ways I can make you shrimp and grits. We got the window open. I was trying to let Princess uh, Booty Smell get out. Why are you still watching me? I was waiting for you to bite the lobster. I did already. Damn. I want to be a piece of lobster so bad right now. Show time, baby. <laughs> Damn, it didn't look like that when I gave it to you. Don't look at me like that and you making eye contact. I'm up here. So what you looking at? Love you. Now don't bother me for three hours. Thank you. So you're not going to come and bother me? That's crazy. That's crazy. That is crazy. I feel like I just pulled a woman card, but that's crazy because I even gave you a countdown and you didn't come. Hmm. Keep that same energy. So y'all, 
Ooh. I said I was supposed to be vlogging what I cooked today, right? Because mm. I cooked breakfast. See y'all three hours. And now I'm cooking, you know, dinner. Y'all, how <laughs> we end up going to sleep. And I feel I'm mad because it's her fault. Because all she ever want to do is sleep. Like, I ain't never met a skinny person who always want to hibernate. Like, what's the problem? So now we're on the way to Kroger <laughs> at like 1030 because... Before I went to sleep, I Somebody ate. Somebody forgot milk. I forgot milk, and then I ate the rest of the milk before I went to sleep. So, now we need milk. Cool. It don't matter. You know, I'm probably going to be like a black person, walk in the store, and I have to pick up extra stuff all of a sudden. <laughs> but whatever. So, it look like we're going to be eating dinner at midnight. We're going to be up anyways. <sighs> but anyways, you guys, she, um, we're going to be up because she's supposed to be leaving at 1 a.m. anyways. You. <laughs> to do what? <laughs> <laughs> Why your face looks so serious? Because <laughs> you so serious right now. Where the fuck I'm going? You tell me. That's something I didn't know. I'm just playing. You didn't touch my lip. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> that's how I felt a fucking second ago. Y'all, I don't understand. She really annoying for real. And I'm really she upset about it. Up. Because I really don't like taking naps. So I'm actually kind of <laughs> mad. Like, I really woke up kind of frustrated that I've been asleep this long. And I know you're all like, who gets mad over being asleep? <laughs> <Right>. Me! <laughs> Me! Because I don't take naps. When because I didn't miss great the, hours of the day. You the one decided to go to sleep. No, I didn't. I decided yes, to just... did. You went to sleep first. You was snoring. So I'm like, shit, I might cut off this boobie and get this nap in. Shit. I wanted to watch the movie. No, so why would you, you cut it off? Eyelids. So why would you cut it off? Stop <laughs> doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Go. Stop doing what? Stop. No, you're annoying all the time. Why well, can't be annoying? Because when I'm annoying, you don't like it. Because you're very annoying. I'm not even kind of annoying. I'm just like yeah. slightly annoying. Y'all, we'll be back. But if I'm going to use it, darling. Right, because you got a lot of teeth. <laughs> Your mother. <laughs> oh, mama, y'all heard what she said. So, she said we talking about my damn teeth. Technically, you, you must be talking about, you're not talking about my mother because I don't got a mother. You got a mother. I got a mother. Mother, mother, word to your mother. Word to your mama, cuz. <laughs> yeah, she's so cute. Even though she just woke up being rude to me. Cause you woke us up in a fright. So, hey, what up, Sega? We'll go down. <laughs> Y'all, this one I'm mad I went to sleep. I'm finna make this food like it's not 11 o'clock and I have to literally boil rock solid potato. This shit about to be boiling for an hour. No, it's not, because I'm finna cut them in half and put them in this pot, but huh, bear with me. Okay, y'all, so I put the potatoes on and we're making asparagus with it. I got the asparagus. I got some lemons and all that good stuff. Um, I'm about to cut up the vegetables for the beef tips. And I guess start cooking them down. Um, y'all, if y'all don't season y'all beef tips with this, I don't know to tell you. This is literally the best shit to put on it. Um, yeah, and then we're gonna be right back. Okay, you guys, so I got the potatoes on. They gon' they gonna take some time. So in the meantime, we just gonna start on this. So I put a little butter in there, some garlic, and then we got some onions, some orange bell pepper, some green bell pepper. My lemons, this for my asparagus, because y'all, if you make asparagus and you don't put lemon on your asparagus, I know y'all shit nasty and bitter. I cannot eat asparagus without lemon. Um, then we got the beef tips. I'm gonna season these in the pan. I am going to rinse them before I put them in there. So, yeah, but back to this, okay? Y'all say y'all like my cooking vlog, so keep running them up for me, period. So just gonna dump this in there, okay? She just washed the dishes, but I don't give a fuck. Um, so, you're just going to let this cook down. I like my veggies soft. 
I don't know what's the word, transparent, translucent. It's one of them, but I like my veggies soft. And once they get to that certain point where they basically are soft and you can like mush them or, you know, you know they're gonna cook in the way you need to and not just sit on top because who like their vegetables crunchy? Ew. Um, that's when we're gonna add the meat in. So let me go rinse my meat and all that and I'll be back. Okay, y'all, so I just put the meat in. So, another thing, when your vegetables, and you feel like they're gonna burn, I always just add a little bit of this to the pan. That give your vegetables color and they let it cook down quicker. So my vegetables are perfectly soft. So before this get too brown, we now gotta add the seasoning because this will get brown real quick and then it is really hard to get flavor and meat that is cooked. So, Tony Satchers. Of course, y'all, if I have to add more seasoning after, I will. But right now, that's what we're doing. So, now we'll say beef, for some reason, does not hold salt. So, like, it will not hold it for some reason. I don't understand. Y'all, I need to hit my friend up and say, girl, I'm all right. I am all right. Ain't nothing in here. Nothing. I hate the smell of raw beef, so y'all, when I say this thing, it's this thing. Adobo, because I put this on everything. That other seasoning, y'all, that I said I put on everything, every time I go to the store, I literally forget to grab it, okay? Literally. Y'all, you have to be heavy on the seasoning, especially when doing beef. Beef will not hold it. Like literally will not. Cause when I mix this in, it's gonna look like I barely see this in the watch. Hold on. Now we just go mix that around. Okay, y'all, so I went back in and I added some, what's this, garlic salt. And I'm adding that because, you know, sometimes just salt just don't be salt, okay? It just don't be doing what's supposed to be doing. And I'm going to go in and I'm going to add this. And now we're just really going to let this cook down. Okay, y'all, so once your meat starts to look like this and everything is cooked, that's when you would add water. That's gonna slow down the cooking process, but at the same time, it's gonna soften the meat. Now we just want the meat to get tender and like soften before we, you know, add our gravy. However, it's already started to make a natural gravy. So we just gonna let this cook for about 15 minutes, let it get soft, and then we're gonna come back, add the gravy, and this will be done. I don't know how much longer we have on these potatoes, but I'm finna start on the asparagus. Okay, y'all, so now that this is getting soft, I already put one packet of the gravy mixture in there. I'm about to let this water boil some more, let it get thick. I wanna know how thick it's gonna get, and then we're gonna add the other one. Y'all, so look, I know how to make gravy, but y'all know I don't be feeling like it sometimes. So look, this is what we doing. And I think my potatoes, oh yeah, they're almost ready. So I'm about to go ahead and start this asparagus. I'm gonna do it. So for my asparagus, y'all, this butter right here, hit different, okay? Hit different. So, let me put some of that in the pan. <laughs> y'all, for my asparagus cooking.
the key ingredient my asparagus, I'm not gonna lie, it's lemon pepper. If you, I just, I just feel like if your asparagus don't taste like lemon, we got a problem. Yeah, I can tell them it's strict. Yeah, we really got company. We don't, we're not going to put y'all in her business. Oh, okay. Okay, y'all, just added some more water, so we're just going to. And then we're just gonna mix that in. Now, and honestly, the beef chips is about done. We're just gonna let this cook a little longer. Let's taste one. I'm gonna put this on low. Y'all, so my beef chips done. I'm finna put these in the oven. Let me see everybody ready to eat. Y'all, it's currently after midnight, but it don't matter. Cause we're gonna be up, so we're gonna eat it. I'm gonna put this in the oven. My spirit is low key done too. I just like mine soft. So once they get soft, y'all, they done. Okay, y'all. <clears throat> these finally done. So I'm gonna show y'all how I make mine, okay? What the fuck? Okay, y'all, so, I only, hold on. I only use lactate milk because I'm not gonna mess up my stomach. So, we got this, this, salt and pepper, okay? So, okay, now look. I already told y'all before. I season like my ancestors. Let me get the butter. We are back. Okay, y'all. I put some regular butter down in there and the lemon and herb because it's butter. What, what's butter gonna do? Come on, come on. Okay. So we're just gonna mix this around to a soft. Okay, hold on. So y'all, y'all, this was just on my first go. So once it's at the consistency you need, then you're just gonna season it and mix it around again. So let's just season it until my ancestors tell me not to. My ancestors ain't said nothing yet. Oh, okay, they say something. All right, hopefully my ancestors speak soon. Now I will say, when you're making fresh mashed potatoes, y'all, y'all do need a lot of salt. I know black people are like, oh my God, salt. Oh my God, okay, but do you want to taste potato? Ew. Hold on. Okay, y'all. 
homemade mashed potatoes. This is different, but they done. And they smooth. Let's see, look. I can do this. Hold on, let's taste them. Y'all, yeah, so I'm really done cooking dinner for real, but I am finna make me some tea because truth be told, I really haven't been feeling good. I've been trying to make content for y'all every day because I promise. But honestly, y'all, I've been really feeling near death every day. Um, I don't know. It's it's allergy season out here in Texas. And I don't know. I've been having trouble breathing. I've been like my sinuses or whatever. And this happens to me every year. So I know that it's probably like because of the weather and my bronchitis might flare up, but... I'm just trying to do what I can. So I'm about to make me some tea right now. I'm about to boil this. And once my tea is done, then I'm gonna end this vlog. Cause y'all, this vlog is forever. I've never cooked y'all two meals in one vlog. Y'all should really be happy, but, ooh, y'all, okay. So I got me some lemon ginger tea and some sleepy time honey tea. And then I usually medicate, like add some NyQuil to my tea. It's actually really good, you can't taste it. So. Cozy chamomile. I don't know who put this stuff in here, but y'all, so I'm about to go ahead and make me some tea and then I'm gonna come right back. Okay, you guys, I low key forgot to end my video because I decided to take a hot shower because y'all, I'm really not feeling well. This weather is killing me. But be sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend today, granddaddy. If y'all not cooking like me, you don't know what to tell you. And we out.